Hi friends, I'm here in my bathroom sink because I'm going to do therapy selfies today. Not everybody has a beekeeper friend or an apotherapist or someone to help, so it's good if you can do this on your own. Um, before you do this, make sure you have an EpiPen, always have an EpiPen, and a charged cell phone nearby. And it's important to take vitamin C, at least 3,000 milligrams a day. And uh, I've done all that, so let's get started. I happen to have a mirrored cabinet, which makes this easy, so I just open it a little like that. And I already have my bees secured on tweezers. I'll be doing 10 stings today, one inch to the right and left of my spine. So I've got them on the tweezer like this. I place it right like that. And there we go. That's my first sting. I like to put them in a little water, a little bit of liquid dish soap. And then I'll do my second one to the other side. Sometimes they need to be tapped. There we go. And I'm spacing them one inch to the right and left of the spine. And then about one inch down, or as close as I can get doing this myself, looking in a mirror. How am I doing? I've had a lot of stings. I've had about 1,500 or so. So I'm just working in between old stings. Don't think it's always been this easy. The first few times I tried this, it was a fiasco. So if you try this and it doesn't go so well, just keep trying. It takes a little practice. Okay, I've got three more to go. Okay, last one, this is the 10th. I alternate the upper and lower back, so if I were doing my lower back, I would come in like this. So you just, your tweezers are about six inches long, so you can reach all the spots you need just like that. So we'll leave these stingers in for 20 minutes, and then uh, we'll remove them, so I'll be back soon.